Oh, hey, it's lunchtime. Let's get after it. I'm gonna have a little bit of fucking tuna today. Gotta get those omega-3 fatty acids right up in my fatty ass. It, for the past month, I've been pretty much just eating the same thing for lunch, similar to what I do for breakfast. Uh, I have uh, one serving of 0% phage or faye Greek yogurt. I have that with a uh, third of a cup of like a granola kind or uh, some other brand I use. Um, a little bit of uh, organic raw honey, it's very good for you. And uh, organic blueberries. But I feel a little sick of that. I wanna spice it up today. And uh, honestly, one of the things that I'm trying to do is improve my uh, sentences, my cognitive function. Uh, because like I do so much talking for a living and sometimes I just feel like my brain isn't working the way that I want it to. And it may be that I'm not having enough fish because omega-3 fatty acids really help with the uh, cognitive function and uh, you know, sentence for me. I'm not gonna take nootropics because those aren't real. Uh, like lion's mane and shepherd's taint. I'm just gonna have some fucking tuna and I'm gonna have a little mayo. And you know what? It's regular mayonnaise. I don't need light mayonnaise. If you're gonna have mayonnaise, just eat the real thing. Uh, you can have a tablespoon. It's 100 calories, it's a lot. Just kind of eyeball it. I need to bring out the tablespoon. Uh, and then I got these Johns. Uh, this is hoagie spread. Now where I come from in Massachusetts, we just call them hots. When you order a sub, you're like, hey, can I get that with hots? Let me get a little valley special with hots and they know what to do. Uh, but in this case, it's just, uh, it's the same shit. It's just chopped up hot peppers. Uh, it's got five calories and a tablespoon, whatever. That's not gonna break the bank. Toss that shit in there. Get a little spice in your life. Uh, that look good? Hot. You got your tuna, you got your mayo, you got your, uh, your little spices in there. But how do you take things to the next level? Avocado, that's right. Organic avocado. You don't have to buy all your veggies organic, but it really helps to buy some of them organic. The ones that matter, and avocado is one of the ones that matter. Let's cut this bad boy up. Now I know not everybody loved my knife skills yesterday because my fingers weren't tucked. Well, here's the thing. This knife is so fucking dull, it wouldn't cut me if I came down full force like that. And I'm not going to. Uh, but everybody knows how to cut an avocado. It's a good time. You can do it as a little parlor trick for your friends if you want. A little slice around the top, give it the old Cincinnati twist. And there you got your avocado. If I wanted to be bold, I'd do the whole shing shop, twist a rooney, get that guy out. But I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna take the, the lazy way out. Just chop this bad boy, boom. And, uh, and then I'm just gonna take it and throw it right in there. Nothing too fancy. I'll mash it all together. It's all going in the same place. My gullet. So uh, I'm just gonna toss it in there. What's nice is I bought these avocados today. Let me make sure I get plenty of the skin in there. I bought these avocados today and uh, they're ripe, they're ready to go, which is great because sometimes I'll buy avocados and I'll say to myself, great, I can't wait to throw these out in four days since I didn't use them. But in this case, these are ripe and ready to go and I bought four of them, which means I'll only throw out three and a half now because this guy is gonna end up in the trash. Guaranteed. So now I'm just gonna mash this shit together Really get it in there. You can kind of dice the avocados up. I'm not too precious about it. I'm just trying to add a little flavor in here. Um, and uh, also add some good unsaturated fats. Or is that saturated? I don't know. It's the good fat. Avocado's the good fat. Avocados from Mexico. And that's it. I'm not putting it on bread. I'm just, I'm not carb conscious, you know? I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to eat uh, healthy the past month or so and uh, you know, get ready to get back on tour, get ready for uh, getting back in the studio. And like, if I wanted a sandwich, I'd have a sandwich. It's no big deal. Put it in my calorie counter, I'm good to go. I don't need it. This is, this is all I need. Just some fucking tuna, tablespoon of mayo, some hots or hoagie spread if you're trash, and half an organic avocado. And that is my lunch for today. Content.